Firefighters made a daring rescue overnight in Tamarack and pulled a man out of a burning home. CBS 4's Gabby Fleischman is live for us at the scene with what neighbors had to say. Gabby? Elliot, those neighbors tell us the flames were so intense they were shooting through the roof of the home. It is a total loss. Take a look. All of the windows were blown out by this fire. Inside, it is destroyed. This is actually the room of one of the men who live here. You can see what's left of the mattress, pretty much nothing. Firefighters say that man was actually trapped inside of the burning home, and they were able to rescue him just in time. Oh, my God. God, I saw the flame shooting. A home burned down to the frame. Everything inside turned to ash. It was terrible. It was awful. Just before midnight, this house at Northwest 50th Street and 47th Terrace in Tamarack went up in flames. I was hearing big booms, so I thought it was my brother, so I came to check through the front window, and I saw fire coming out of the window, so I ran to go wake up my grandma and everybody. Several neighbors who saw the flames bursting through windows and shooting through the roof ran out of their homes, afraid that the fire would spread. It was coming through every window and it hit the roof. I was honestly scared because I didn't know if anybody was still in the house or anything. Nobody knew there was still a man trapped inside until they saw firefighters pull him out from the burning home and put him in an ambulance. I hope he's okay. While crews worked to extinguish the flames, part of the roof came crashing down on them. The uh, fire was extremely intense and it went through the roof. Uh, as we were starting to knock it down, the uh, roof collapsed on our uh, firefighters. We exited the structure. We went into a defensive attack, uh, and then uh, we got the fire under control. None of the firefighters were injured. The homeowner's brother says his brother wasn't home at the time the fire broke out, and the man injured is a friend staying with him. They say he's a smoker, but they don't know what happened. feel pretty bad, but, uh, you know, thanks God, is nobody got hurt. And the homeowner says his injured friend is being treated at the hospital for smoke inhalation, but he doesn't know his condition right now. The cause of the fire remains under investigation. We're live from Tamarack, Gabby Fleischman, CBS4 News.